So in this video, I will show you how to create your own virtual dollar card that you can use to make international payments on different websites in the world. All right. So a lot of people have been looking for virtual card that they can use because of the current issues that we are facing in Nigeria of today. So the Central Bank of Nigeria has blocked so many opportunities that Nigerians would have used to make a payment online. Of course, if you are familiar, your Naira ATM card, that's your Naira MasterCard or Visa card, has just a limit of $20 per month that you can use to make payments online on any website in the world or any um, international payment. So what, what kind of transaction do you want to use for, for such a limit? For parents who want to pay their children's school fees online, run into thousands of dollars. So definitely you are going to require an alternative for, for, for such. So that is the reason why a lot of Nigerians are now going towards um, virtual card so that you can get an alternative means to make international payments within the country. So in this video, I will show you how to create a virtual card which you can use to make payments online as long as that website or merchant accept Visa card or MasterCard payment, then you are good to go. So if you are ready for it, let's dive into it. This video was brought to you by Sogit. Buy or sell your Bitcoin and perfect money on Sogit.com. We will pay you instantly within two minutes. Sign up today at Sogit.com slash register. All right, welcome back. So the platform that we use to create a virtual card is called Cheaper Cash. I, I, I guess some of you may have heard of Cheaper Cash, but you don't know about their virtual card. So Cheaper Cash is a popular fintech company based in Africa, and they offer a virtual card which you can use to make online payments on any website in the world as long as the site accepts Visa card or MasterCard. You can use it to pay for your Facebook adverts, you can use it to shop on Amazon, AliExpress, alright? So I've used it to pay for a web hosting for my hosting um, account on my website, GoDaddy, uh, Bluehost. So it works even on paper, you can link the card to your PayPal account. And, and then it's, it works smoothly for paper payments. So if you want to get the virtual card, first of all, you need to download the cheaper cash mobile app on your Play Store. So for me, in this video, I'm using my Android. So just go to the Play Store, all right? So when you get to your Play Store, so just, um, you just simply search for cheap, just type cheaper cash, okay? So as you can see, this is the cheaper cash in my app. Of course, it's already on my phone. That's why you can see that this open a button is here. So this is the app which you can just use a confirm. That's five million downloads. So once you are done, once you are okay, once you've installed the app, so you simply open it on your device. So I just click on this open here. All right. So this this is the um, login page of the app because it's already on my phone. So once you download the app. You, of course, for the first time, you will need to register. So as, as a first timer, you register on the uh, an account on the app. So when you register, you are going to be required to uh, uh, do some, some verification for a new beginner onboarding process. So I actually have a video on that. So I'll leave in the description below. I did an extensive video on how to create your own shipper cash account. And I also did a video on how to um, verify okay yeah if that same video on how you can verify your cheaper cash account so i'll just leave the link in this description so you can get the entire process so once your account is verified uh, for um, i remember for you to verify your cheaper cash account you'll be required to submit your bvn and a an id card so the id card they accept they accept the nim slip they accept your driver's license, international passport. So those are the major identification documents that you'll be required to submit for your account to be verified. So once your account is verified and you are fully onboarded, you simply log into your account. So I'll just log into my account here, all right? All right, so I'm logged in already to my cheaper cash account. So as you can see, my account is already verified. So you can see this is the information on my account. Of course, cheaper cash is like it's also a fintech company. 
just like a mini bank so you can also use yeah you can use it to do um uh, transfers in nigeria naira uh, transfer to other banks buy airtime data you get so but for this video i want to show you how you can apply or how you can create your own virtual uh, card for international payments so once you are on your cheaper cash and it's verified you simply come down here to this uh, uh, bottom right hand section just click on card all right so you can see this is my this is the card section on cheaper cash and this is my cheaper cash virtual card so cheaper cash offers two kinds of virtual cards which you can use to make payment they are both visa card so they offer the naira a uh, visa card and they also offer us dollar a uh, visa card so the naira visa card is just like your normal atm card but this is, is just a card that you can use to make a uh, payment online so if you want to make a naira payment online for example you want to make payment on probably a uh, pay stack interswish flutter wave so you can use the you can create a naira visa card so why this is important for those who don't have atm card or probably your atm card have expired and you are yet to go to the bank to uh, apply for a, a fresh atm card or you are outside of the country and you don't have your atm card or you, you don't have your atm card with you there and you want to make a an, a, a a web payment in, in within nigeria in, on a nigerian uh, merchant website so the the naira visa card will be very handy so if you want to apply for it just simply come here and click on claim ngn card so once you click on this claim ngn card the card will be automatically created for you but for for some time like when i created my usd card it took like um i think uh, within two to four hours so the the it seems it went on a manual review so the the cheaper cash uh, back-end staff seems they they would look into it and they created but within four hours i got my usd card details so but i don't know for this ngn card because i don't i don't need it per se because i already have i have several i have atm card in nigeria that i used to make payment so but if you want to do that just click on this claim ngn card so and the card will be created and the details will be generated for you which you can use to make payments online so but the the purpose of this video is the usd card so i'll just go to the usd section which is at the top right hand side of this screen so just click on usd card all right so you can see my usd card is already here and you can see that my usd card is already created so because my usd card has already been created so if you are a first time user or you are just applying for the first time just the information you saw on the ngn section just this section here you will just see it on the usd section so now you see something like usd card available now claim usd card so for the usd section you just click on the claim usd card and once you click on that like i said it will, it will go under a manual check so within two hours cheaper cash will, will activate your usd card and the next time you log into your uh, your cheaper cash app you will see the information would be displayed like this so this is my usd card this is my usd card that has been created or is already active active on the cheaper cash and you can see that my current balance is eight dollar ninety cent so if i click on this show card details you will see the entire card details but for security reasons i do not want to do that so that the 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 my card will not be compromised so but when you click on the show card details you will see the complete 16 uh, digit card number you will see the expiry date of course then you see the cvv number which is three three digits you see it. so those are the information that you'll be required whenever you want to make a web payment on any website as long as that site accepts visa or mastercard so those are the card payments you you, you you those are the card information that you'll be required to submit so now the the card if whenever you want to um, load money to the card or whenever you want to use the card to make payment online and the money you want to pay online is, is the money on your card is not up to the money you want to pay online so there or, or on the website so of course you will need to add funds to your card so for you to add funds or add dollars to your card you simply click on this add fund here from cheaper wallet so that's why i so much like the cheaper cash card is very almost very instant so if you want to add funds to your card simply just click on add funds from cheaper wallet so 
let's so once you want to add the the the, the US dollar, of course. The Naira is what you will use and it will be exchanged and converted to dollar in your account. So let's say you want to have, of course, let me go back. So you see that my current balance on the card now is $8.90. So if I want to add funds, let's say I want to add like, um, so let's just click on add funds. So let me just say, let me add like, okay, so I don't know the dollar amount. So let me just say 2000 Naira. All right. So you can see that 2000 Naira. It's, it's it's give me equivalent of two dollars seventy seven cents. So the exchange rate that cheaper cash uses, of course, uh, you, you you can you can easily calculate it. So as you can see on the screen, so that that is um seven two two point zero two. So you can see that's seven hundred and twenty two naira, which which is 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 quite on the high side. So that is the 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 setback, a little setback. The exchange rate that they use to credit your card. Is kind of on the high side so but once but once you are done with the uh, the uh, calculation and you want to credit your 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 card simply click on add funds all right it says you have added two two dollars seventy seven cents to your cheaper visa usd card okay then two thousand naira has been deducted from your cheaper wallet so just click on done once i'm okay with that all right so now you can see that my current balance on the on the virtual card now is eleven dollars sixty six cents so this is how you can create and use your uh, virtual card in nigeria and with this you can now use to make payment on any websites in the world as long as the site accepts um visa or master so I, like i said i've used the card on different sites i've used to pay for facebook amazon and even on paper i've linked the card to my i've linked my cheaper cash um, card to my paypal account okay so i'll click on confirm here all right so your bank prepaid has been confirmed so that is how you link your cheaper cash virtual card to paper and you can use it to make payments on paper and also you can use to withdraw paper funds to the card then it works very well on paper so you can use it to make payment on sites on, on, on any website that accept paper payment so you can link you can link the card to your paper uh, account and use it to make payments via paper so that is a information about this um, official card so i hope you got the process and i hope you enjoyed the video please uh, like it and uh, also remember to subscribe to our channel so you can receive more videos like this from us in future so thank you for your time guys and i'll see you again in the next video goodbye this video was brought to you by sogit buy or sell your bitcoin and perfect money on sogit.com we will pay you instantly within two minutes sign up today at sogit.com register